Yo, it's Lux from Server Pro, and welcome to this tutorial in which I'm going to show you how to install and use the MySQL Inventory Bridge plugin. This plugin allows you to link inventory between multiple Minecraft servers using a MySQL database. This means that you can have the same inventory items on two separate servers. You can use this on a bungee cord network as well. As long as you have a MySQL database, you can do this. To install the plugin, head over to the plugin section, go over to the spigot tab and search for MySQL inventory bridge like so. Install the version that is compatible with your server and restart. Alternatively, you can download it from the plugin page and upload it into your plugins folder manually. The next step is to ensure that you install this plugin on all the servers you want to share the inventory on. I'm using two different servers and I have installed the plugin on both of them. Now, of course, for this plugin, you'll need a MySQL database. On Server Pro, we provide you with one on our Pro plans. If you're not using Server Pro, ensure that you have a database and that it's online and running. To enable your MySQL database on Server Pro, go over to the MySQL tab and click Enable. This will give you your details. But before you go and enter those details into the config of the plugin, you'll need to restart your server for the appropriate files to generate. Once you completely restart your server, you should see a MySQL folder in your files tab. Make sure it's there, otherwise the next step will not work. For this, you will only need one MySQL database as you'll be linking everything to it. Now, once you enabled MySQL, locate the config file in the plugins folder. Then, one by one, enter in your details like so. I like to create two windows so I can quickly copy and paste the necessary information into the config. Now go and enter in the exact same details into your other servers too. Once that's done, restart your other servers and you're ready to go. When I join my first server, you can see that I have the armor and a few items in my inventory. When I log out and join the second server, you can see that I have the exact same inventory items on both servers. You can play around with a few options in the config, like whether you want to link armor, but that's all up to you. So go check out the config and decide what you'd like to keep. Apart from that, I hope this tutorial was helpful. If you have any plugin suggestions, leave them down in the comments below. And if you're having issues with anything, contact our support team. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.